We're gonna check in with our first guest. So excited. Really excited about this because Devour Indie Winterfest Edition is kicking off January 22nd through February 4th. Yes. And it gives locals the chance to try unique, exciting, and value priced menu items for more than 100 restaurants. Hey guys. Hi. Hey. So, so, here so happy to, tell to be us here. More. We've got Hunter, we've got Jessica from San Giovese Restaurante. And Hunter is here because he actually won the cocktail competition yesterday. Congratulations. Thank Thank you so much. Appreciate that. Yes. So we love San Giovese. I know you do too. Yes. Right? It's great food. But you're talking about the winning cocktail. What are you making? Yeah. So today we're going to be making uh, our live and let die. So it's going to be a, uh, a bourbon infused like with pineapple. And then we're going to add just, you know, a little Campari, a pineapple simple and lime juice. We're keeping it very simple, but it's obviously a award winner. So oh, perfect. We'll let, we'll let you get to it. We're going to find out why he won. Yeah. <laughs> Looking forward to it. And then as he's making that cocktail, let's talk about San Giovese and what you're doing with Devour. Of course. So we are super excited to be participating in Devour again. Yeah. Um, I always like to say to everyone, our menu is top notch. Um, we are one of the only devour menus that I found that offers a cocktail or alcoholic beverage with the menu. Wow. So not only do you get a beverage, we also have three other courses to choose from. Our menu also is pretty extensive in our choices. So there's a lot to pick from. Love that. Yes. Fantastic. Can you tell me a little bit more about what is Devour Indie? So Devour Indie, we come together to do a preset limited menu for a fixed price. Mm -hmm. We love to bring in people who have never dined with us before, give them a little taste of what San Giovese is all about, and then it gives us a chance to also splurge on our regulars as well to give them a little something to look forward to. Yeah. Perfect. Now, Hunter, what have you put in here so far? Yes, so this is, we're using our Woodford Double Oak, which was in the competition for yesterday. Uh, so that is just, yeah, infused with pineapple. We're gonna do that for about four to five days, strain right. it off, and then we add just this nice pineapple uh, simple syrup. Then we have just classic lime juice and then the uh, Campari, which is gonna give it a little bitterness, but it's gonna cut just a little sweetness, but not take away that bourbon flavor. Ooh, nice. All right, we're mixing it up here. We do that got it ready to go. Yeah, for you. Oh, yes. you gotta have the ice. You gotta have the ice. And as they're putting that together, I cannot help but notice. I know this is probably gonna be part of the garnish, but this little branded San Giovese orange peel. How cute is that? I don't know how oh. you did that. <laughs> but I love this. That is adorable. So we have a nice little personal stamp made. Heat it up, press it on the orange peel. It also kind of gets the aromas out of the orange as well. Super, super fun. Yeah, I love that sound. Mm -hmm. Even though <laughs> you're watching live on Fox, it's just after 10 in the morning. You're watching on CBS, it's just after 3. So I don't know which one's better, but we're here to celebrate. <laughs> Mixing that up. What is your favorite thing on the menu at San Giovese? I know that's probably tough for you to say. So my personal favorite item, I'm going to go with our classic fettuccine Alfredo chicken. I feel like it's an easy yeah. go-to. You cannot go wrong with it. Favorite devour menu item is definitely going to be the five cheese ravioli spicy marinara. It's not traditionally on our menu but everyone looks forward to it every devour when we have that. Oh, yeah. That's yes, incredible. super tasty. Incredible. Okay. All right, you ready to try these cocktails, yeah, let's Krista? Try okay, let's do it. I like We've the coloring. Got a little garnish well. here. Yeah. See that, uh, the uh, Campari really gives it a nice pink hue. And yeah. Awesome. Now, the cocktail competition yesterday. There you go, Krista. Thanks. Tell us a little bit more about that event. Yeah, so yesterday went to the RNDC uh, headquarters right south of Lucas Oil. Um, it was nine of us that were competing. Um, and then we all had like tables that we could set up. We all had samples. And then we had a panel of judges that um, would sit in the back. We would all make our cocktails and then, you know, blind taste test. Yes. So end up winning the all three categories and took home the prize for San Giovese. That's right. Great. Yeah, I saw our friend Taylor was actually emceeing that event. It looked really fun. Well, cheers, you cheers. guys. Cheers. I could not wait to try this. Cheers. 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 Here we go, moment of truth. Oh, oh wow, that is fantastic. Oh, that is so Ooh. complex. Mm -hmm. It's but so simple. Yes, right, right. Mm -hmm. It's one of those where like as you're taking a sip, you're thinking, what am I tasting? And look at that. You can see the aromas from that orange right there. Mm. And then we want to tell everyone, keep an eye out so good. for this cocktail. We will be featuring this soon to come our new location coming in Carmel this year.
Oh my goodness. Yep. Okay, so new spot. New spot. Yep. Super excited. A little different of a concept, but still in the Sangiovese family. That's going to be great. Yeah. Yep. Wow. So look for Trey come March 2024. Well, congratulations. Thank you. And congrats on the win. We can certainly yes. see why yes. you won. <laughs> Thank you. So if you go there, you have to try this cocktail. Check out the Devour menu. Again, Devour is going on January 22nd through February 4th, and there are more than 100 different restaurants that you can check out with special deals all during that time. Thank you guys so much for giving Thank us a little preview. Thank you for having us. Cheers. Yes. Cheers. Thank you. Cheers. Coming up. Up next, if you're looking for a new brunch spot to try out this weekend, we have got the perfect recommendation for you. We have Chef Sal from Breadworks stopping by to give us a sneak peek at the menu for their first brunch this Saturday. Andy now will be right back. Oh, this is delicious. <laughs> Oh my goodness, isn't that great? I know that I've had pineapple simple syrup. I know.